Howdy, my name is Daniela Martin Del Campo. I am a senior at Texas A&M. I'll be graduating this May. And following graduation, I'll be working for a little bit and then applying to physician assistant graduate programs. That is what I would like to one day become, is a physician assistant. And basically, I got interested in it. Starting in college, I did a lot of volunteering and shadowing with doctors and um, nurse practitioners and other physician assistants. And so I kind of got a lot of exposure to all the different jobs that you can do in healthcare. And there's a lot that you can do with our degree, biomedical sciences. And so from those experiences, I got to see a lot of cool cases, um, some tumors, like a brain tumor. I got to see that with an endocrinologist. And so after you know, spending time with all those providers and seeing how they were changing people's lives, I knew that I wanted to do something that would be just as impactful. And I really enjoyed talking to people and spending time and getting to know people and getting involved in their lives and making little differences or when possible a big difference for the better. And I think that's something that I've always liked to do even when I was younger. I've always been very friendly and I love you know, spending time with friends and with my family. And so I know that when I grew up, I wanted to do something with people. Um, and so in high school, I didn't quite know what I wanted to do. And in junior high, I actually wanted to be a teacher and then things change and as you go through life you meet different people and you get involved with different experiences and I was actually in an environmental club I was in what was called the green club and we were trying to bring in recycling programs for the school and I kind of thought that I was going to end up doing something like that but things change um, and then if I could give y'all advice for you know, as you keep moving along in school, I would say to be sure to always focus on your grades, but also have some time to spend with friends and with family. And because as you go through life, you're going to lean on your family for a lot of support. And so it's a good time to um, make those connections and those relationships with them because one day you're going to be off at college and you're going to miss everybody. So spend time when you can with your family and friends.